Today, I'm taking my break with Andy Day, the Director of Primary Care for Richmond and Vancouver. Andy is a record-breaking relay champion, and today, I'm gonna try and make his team. Okay, so when did you start running relay? Quite new to me, actually. I actually used to do track and field up until the age of 16. Okay. And then I took a 30-year break <laughs> from track and field. Um, and I've always kept fit because my other passion is I do a lot of weight training and gym work. Yeah. And a friend of mine said, oh, I've just started at this track and field club. Why didn't you, why don't you come and join us? So I went back at the age of uh, 46. Okay. You'll start running okay. and then I will say, you, yeah. you, you, <laughs> as soon as you feel that your hand is clamped on it and then you just push. I heard a rumor that you recently broke a record at the BC Masters Outdoor Track and Field Competition, is that right? Yeah, so with a few of the other guys, I'm in yep. the 45 plus age group, okay. that's all you need to know. <laughs> um, I bought, it was a 4 by 100 meter relay yeah. and it was a record for the province of British Columbia. Okay, so we... I heard, I heard it was 47.54 seconds, does that yeah. ring a bell? That rings a bell, yeah, yeah it's something around there, yeah. Okay, what else can you do in 47? seconds. Oh, I could probably do 30 push-ups. 30 push-ups? Yeah, do okay. I need to demonstrate that yeah, or not? Yeah, we're going to have to get you to demonstrate yeah, yeah. that after. I'm going to be out with my phone yeah, timer. Yeah. I'm going to start going. Just stop. <laughs> no, you, you, you hit there, you got to hit there. Okay, okay. And is there a part of your personality that you think helps you both at work and on the track? One thing that I do like with track, it does take you out your comfort zone. Yeah. When you're competing competitively with other people, it takes you out your comfort zone. I've been to track competitions where I'm actually the oldest, comp oldest competitor. Okay. And I didn't finish last and I'll finish respectively. And sometimes, it, again, re racing 20, 30, 40 year olds, takes yeah. you out your comfort zone. Yes. But it's actually sometimes really important because mm -hmm. it reminds me of the importance in our work is very often I am asking teams and staff to often work outside their comfort zone mm -hmm. and sometimes I try and mirror that in my, in my track and my athletic life as well. And now that our break is over, what are you looking forward to when it comes to going back to work? Going back to work? It's always about the people and seeing what progress we've made on numerous projects we have happening. Okay, nice, good job. Thank you. <laughs> You've got to be faster than that. I'm not making it at this stadium. I'm not going to be faster than <laughs> <laughs>